the, no, I mean, we had to remodel somewhat when we got here, so, because the pantry used to come out to here. So I know this lady was in the, and there was a guy, I looked up a guy named Richard, and, um, what was her name? Richard and Lynn Deering were here, and there was also a guy named Tom, because when we had the attic cleaned out, um, there were some uh, awards from a guy named Tom, I can't remember his last name, but I don't remember, I tried to look up the information, I can bomb, because when we had the attic cleaned out, um, there were some uh, awards from a guy named Tom, I can't remember his last name, but I don't remember, I tried to look up the information, I couldn't find anything on him living here. Priest came in, um, blessed out every room, and I told you this. He was in the garage walking around the car, and he turned around and he said, I thought you were behind me. I saw a man standing behind me. That's what he said. Oh, and the so priest, I told you, he was goosebumps all up and down. He came in here, was a, he was really freaked out. And then when we were in here, the brush machine starts going bang, 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 bang. And he went over and looked at it. There was something in there, but it wasn't enough to cause it to be out of balance. So that was the other thing. So he told me to put the crosses, he blessed the crosses, told me to put oh, one yeah. there, told me to put one there. I put one up here. He said for some reason, we did say prayers when we heard the noise. Like that. Now right. a lot of the stuff, and those are antiques from her family. So, yeah, they'll Since we've been here? Yeah. Voices? The whole house, yeah. <clears throat> female? Male? Yeah. Both. Mostly female. Just one or two words. to come in here and reach out to you. They say you're bugging them quite a bit. And you're bothering them. Is that you knocking on the walls and the ceiling and stuff like that? Is that you? If you're trying to get their attention, they can't really understand why you would do that. If you're trying to reach out for help or anything, they, they don't know. So that's why we're here. If you need help or trying to tell us something, go for, you can, you can talk to us. We've got some devices on the bed right there. If you touch them, they'll turn colors and light up and that, that'll let us know that you can hear us and understand what we're trying to say. Does that sound good? Do you understand what I'm telling you? Does that 
that sound good? Do you understand what I'm telling you? We come here out of respect, we mean no harm. Did you used to live in this house? Touch, touch these boxes on the bed if you used to live in the house. House. Katie with us tonight. Lady, are you here? Lady, are you here? Is there any men here tonight? Can you say something again so Laura can hear you? Maybe say something to her. Can you go stand by her and, and tell her what you need or what you would like? Who's in here? I thought I just heard a me. Really? Yeah, a very breathy me. Who's in here? I thought I just heard a me. Really? Yeah, a very breathy me. In the bathroom. Okay. Who's me? Are you there? Is there somebody in here? Did you say me right now? Sorry, I was rude. I didn't tell you my name. My name is Jamie. What was your name? Talk as loud as you can. It's really hard for us to hear you. It's really hard for us to hear you. Why are you here? Is there a reason?
Inmortal. You can't really hear anything from outside. Just bang one time. Let us know that you can hear us. Let us know that you can hear us. it was right here. Was it the air turning off maybe? Oh, we can't hear from outside. Well, yeah, I just now heard the bird. But I didn't hear anything. Oh, we can't hear from outside. Well, yeah, I just now heard the bird. But I didn't hear anything. The male. Boy, I didn't hear it. Is there something that you need? Is that why you're here? Is there something that you need? Is that why you're here? You touch the, the brush. If you don't want to touch that box, no, touch the brush. See if you can move that. You're upsetting the homeowners. by doing what you're doing. I understand there was a priest that came out and tried to get rid of you. Was that, was, was you here for that? You were upsetting the homeowners by doing what you're doing. I understand there was a priest that came out and tried to get rid of you. Was that was was you here for that? How's the heat signature? So when the priest from the church was here, did that get rid of anybody? Did he help you guys cross over? See very well, that's why you have glasses too. <laughs> Literally, it was like right there. It's a different feel in here for sure. Really? Yeah. You must have come standing there telling you to tell. Someone just says I've got claustrophobic. You must have come standing there telling you to tell. Costume shop, Mardi Gras. Yeah. Well, we're in there. That, kind of that feeling. Pressured. Yeah. yeah. There's a hole underneath. Up. Uh. 
beep so you get out. <laughs> Did you just tell us to get out? Can you see her, please? to us that you exist and that you're here. Okay. That's me. Okay. Sorry. Anything you need? We have these devices, these boxes. You can touch these, make the lights turn, or turn different colors. That's our line of communication that we'd like to open up with you by you turning those colors and touching these boxes that'll let us know that you can hear us. Anything you can do to, to prove to us that you exist and that you're here? Okay. That's me. Okay. Sorry. Anything you need. We have these devices, these boxes. You can touch these, make the lights turn, or turn different colors. That's our line of communication that we'd like to open up with you by you turning those colors and touching these boxes that'll let us know that you can hear us. If you can hear me and understand me and see me, can you touch these boxes, please? Touch these devices. Let us know that you're here. My name is Jamie. With me tonight is my good friend, Laura. Do you have a name? What can we call you?
kind of a cool little gadget. Solo. Are you by yourself? Is that what you're saying? Story. You want to tell us a story? You're all ears. You know where you're at? Is there anywhere we can go to talk to you better? Is there a different room? Anything? Inside, outside? Preacher. Lombard. I don't know if preachers ever come home with that before. No. I'm not a preacher. Run. Alright, you're doing good. What else you got? Can you say anything else? Any other words in there? a word as to why you're here? Barry. B-U-R-Y. Give us a word as to why you're here. There's got to be a word in there that can explain. Maybe the preacher. The preacher had a long bar on it. And it was all the way across. Paranormal. Do you need a preacher? Priest? Was you here when the preacher man was here last time? Do you remember? Flashlight. Oh, okay. yeah. Thank you. Right. <laughs> I, just, I just found that weird. Come in. Anybody back here? Run. Oh, yeah. I was going to ask him what. Preacher. Yeah. I'll, yeah. So, well, I, guys, I don't know how many times we've gone to places and we've been called priests too. Yeah. yeah. But, but I guess the question is, why would? I, I, I was going to ask him. You know, I want like what, what church, that he would run out of a place. Because he felt somebody behind him. Run. Oh, yeah. I was going to ask him what. Preacher. Yeah. I'll, yeah. So, well, I, guys, I don't know how many times we've gone to places and we've been called priests too. Yeah. yeah. But, but I guess the question is, why would? I, I, I was going to ask him. You know, I want like what, what church, that he would run out of a place. Because he felt somebody behind him. It does. It's hot water heater. Anybody in the garage? We've been to other homes where spirits like yourself like to hang out in the garage. Can I turn my flashlight off? 
Oh, it doesn't matter. I didn't realize it was on. Oh, it's just giving you a little ambient light. It'll fall. Anybody in the garage? We've been to other homes where spirits like yourself like to hang out in the garage. Can I turn my flashlight off? Oh, it doesn't matter. I didn't realize it was on. Oh, I was just giving you a little ambient light. It'll fall. <laughs> 